Hi, it's Deacon Andrew, and I'm here with our daily devotion. It's good to be with you all today. Our reading for today comes from the book of Revelation, the 22nd chapter. Let's hear God's word. Jesus says, See, I am coming soon, and my reward is with me, to repay everyone according to their work. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Blessed are those who wash their robes so that they will have the right to the tree of life and may enter the city by the gates. It is I, Jesus, who sent my angel to you with this testimony for the churches. I am the root and the descendant of David, the bright and morning star. The spirit and the bride say, come, and let everyone who hears say, come, and let everyone who is thirsty come. Let anyone who wishes to take the water of life as a gift come. The one who testifies to these things says, Surely I am coming soon. Amen. Come, Lord Jesus. May the grace of the Lord Jesus be with all the saints. Amen. Word of God, word of life. Thanks be to God. If you go to the very, very last page of your Bible, this is the last part of the last chapter of the last book. The story, however, doesn't end there. And that's what we rejoice and celebrate. You see, the story is an open-ended invitation for God's vision of the world to come to fruition. And so the, the end has this sense of bringing others into that story, that language of the spirit and the bride, which is a metaphor for the church, saying, come, come to other people, come hear this good news. And to say to anyone who hears the invitation, come, well, you see, God is always extending an invitation to all humanity to come and join in the goodness of this new kingdom. But for you, how might you yourself come to the Lord today? And also, how might you invite others to share in this glorious grace of God and to heed the invitation to come? I invite you now to pray with me. Lord, you are the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. All these things belong to you. Invite us into the richness of deep relationship with you. Help us to live out your invitational grace that extends your goodness to all people and bring your kingdom to us more and more each day. Amen. Come, Lord Jesus. And now receive a blessing for your day. Beloved child of God, may God bless you and encourage you. May God equip you and guide you as you go out to shine the light of Christ in the world and invite others to come today and this day. May God bless you. Amen.